mind and healthy finances. Um, the health coach that invited you here today is asking. We are asking because we have some answers and we are hoping you get some answers from what you hear today. So we have a little presentation for you and we are hoping to keep this under a half an hour. This is our first time with a brand new slideshow. So um, just keep me on my time if you can. And uh, I'm gonna do my best to really keep it there. I tend to get excited and talk a lot about all the amazing things we're gonna talk about today, um, but I'm gonna try and keep it brief, including right now. So uh, my name is Jackie Catalano. Uh, my husband is also here, he's on Zoom. You can probably see him. I don't know if you wanna come off mute, Mike, and just wave to everybody and say hey so they can see you. Um, so Hi, everybody. <laughs> thanks. So we are independent Optivia health coaches, certified health coaches, and we have been that for the past seven and a half years. Um, obviously, you can see from this picture that we made a big weight transformation using this program, but I always tell people that that's not where the real magic happened. So in our lives, um, the gifts of Optavia just kept on giving. Um, we, we are still on our journey with Optavia, and every single day of our lives, we grow into the people we're meant to become. And this company and all that it stands for has supported us to that. So just a few non-physical changes. We have a more positive mindset. We have a healthy relationship. Um, we have a sense of purpose. We have increased our activity level um, exponentially. We are now in service to others and it feels so good. And we have done so much um, to really work on our financial security and, and the impact we can have in not only our lives with finances, but in the lives of our family and our entire community. So uh, to say we're grateful for the opportunity of health coaching is an understatement. So here we are today, and we're going to really be talking about what we like to call the trilogy of health, um, which is healthy body, healthy mind, and healthy finances. Um, if you take a look at that big number 10 uh, with the big red circle around it, that's where everybody should strive to be. That is what is possible for all of us in this world. Um, and we're going to take a look at each of these areas. And really, if you can grab a pen and paper, I'm going to ask you to take a look at where you are in your life in each of these areas as we start. So take a look at healthy body. And, you know, on a scale of one to 10, with one being really lacking and 10 being abundant, where are you with your healthy weight, your healthy eating? your healthy sleep, your physical activity, uh, your relaxation, your feeling of safety and uh, being in a healthy environment on a scale of one to 10, and then move on to healthy mind. Where are you in your relationships, in your engagement at work, in your fulfillment, in your spiritual time, in your community involvement, um, in, in your hobbies? Do you have time for hobbies? Do you even know what you would do if you had a hobby? Where's your passion? Where's your purpose? Um, and healthy finances on a scale of one to 10. Do you have abundance? Um, do you have freedom? Do you have good money management? Do you have money to dream? Uh, do you have savings for the future or resources to create memories for yourself or for your family or to do the things that you really wanna do in your life or have always dreamt of doing um, or to make community contributions? And really just be honest with yourself in this and just write down those numbers and, and see where you come um, in each of those areas. And so, you know, we're going to start today with some not so great information, right? And, and I'm not coming here to you to be a negative Nancy, but this is reality. And we're going to have a quick like reality check. You can't know where you're, where you want to go if you don't know where you currently are, right? So worldwide statistics right now say that obesity has nearly tripled since 1975. Um, and most of the world's population lives in a country where overweight and obesity kills more people than underweight um, and starvation, which is, which is unlike any other time in the history of the world. Um, back in 2015, I'm going to show you this map really quick. Just take a look at the green. I think it's like a really good visual. This is just six years ago. And if you look at the green, there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven states that have 20 to 25% of an obese population. 
Um, and, and none of the states have less than that in 2015. So we're already looking at what is really an epidemic in our society. Um, and then fast forward just three years. And if you just look at the green, you can already see that those seven went to four. Um, and if you go back to this one and you look at that whole middle area of America where Arkansas and Tennessee and Kentucky, you know, those are like the light orange with it where it's 30 to 35 percent obese. And then you move here to 2018 and you see the bright red. Right. And as if that's not bad enough, this is where we're headed in 2030. So if we continue on this path, you look at the left side and those are the colors. Those colors don't even exist here. Those are the colors that we're going to see. And almost 50% of our entire country of America is going to be obese, with 24% of them being severely obese, morbidly obese. So those aren't really great statistics, right? But let's talk about what the statistics really mean. And let's show you how that shows up in people. Because we can say the word obesity and we've heard it and we're almost kind of like conditioned to it and immune to it. And we know that it, it means like bad health comes, but what does that really mean? Well, if you take a look at this chart, it just kind of gives you an idea of the chronic diseases that are linked to obesity right now. We have cardiovascular disease, um, we have hypertension, we have GERD, we have degenerative joint disease, we have type two diabetes, we have um, POCS, we have uh, migraines and we have asthma and we have gout and the list goes on and on. And when you look at this and you, and you think about those words and you think about um, those conditions, think about the quality of life that comes along with those conditions. And that's what we're really talking about here. We're talking about people not having access to the quality of life that makes you want to live longer, right? Like we're in a time of our lives where we're, where we're given the gift of science that helps us live longer. But if our quality of life isn't there, you know, it's almost like, what's the point? What's the point of living longer if you can't enjoy those years? Um, so let's go back to this slide where we just talked about like the health, the health epidemic. Well, what about um, the stress and financial epidemic? Because we're going to be touching on all of these things today. So we're going to talk about the body and we're going to talk about the mind. And we're going to talk about the finances. And as of right now, almost a third of all adults with partners um, report that money is a major source of conflict in their relationship. So, so what does that mean? Well, Chronic untreated stress can relate to, can lead to anxiety, insomnia, muscle pain, high blood pressure, and a weakened immune system. So now you're taking the financial stress and you're and you're going back to this chart and you're saying how it also um, contributes to an unhealthy lifestyle. And then you go back and you say research within the last decade shows that financial stress on families can cause divorce, problematic behavior in kids, physical pain, or even death. So why does that matter? Well, we can, we can control all of that. And that's really what we're here today to do. We're here today to talk about optimal health. We feel at Optavia, and we're gonna get into who Optavia is and who we are as, as Optavians, um, but we feel at Optavia that when you really have a healthy mind and a healthy body and healthy finances, you're given a ticket to optimal health. And we call it the trilogy of health. And we feel like all three are really very closely related and all contribute to that wheel of life um, and, and how happy and healthy we really are. So let's go to who is Optimia. Um, and I'm gonna pull my notes out here so that I make sure I touch on exactly who we are and, and I don't miss anything that I want you guys to know. So we're a company that's committed to providing solutions for creating optimal health in the world, right? We just talked about what is that optimal health. Um, we're both a corporate office and a full team of over 52,000 health coaches and healthcare professionals across the country, um, and actually in some areas of Asia now. We have a co-founder, his name is Dr. Wayne Scott Anderson, um, there he is, uh, and he's a New York Times bestselling author, and he's also one of the top 10 critical care physicians in the entire country. Um, and he teamed up with our parent company, which is Metafast, for one reason and one reason only, and that was to get America healthy and then the world. Um, we're a leader in safe, effective, and proven um, meal replacements for over 35 years now. Our products and programs have been recommended by doctors since 1980. 
We have clinical studies showing our programs to be both safe and effective. Um, and it's been conducted by researchers from major universities and teaching hospitals. And we're a company where everything is made in America by Americans. And uh, we're a New York Stock Exchange publicly traded company. So there's a lot to be said about who we are and, and why we do what we do. So Optavia, I'm sure a lot of you have heard of it. And if you were invited here today, you were invited by a health coach and um, you may have been invited by another client of ours or a friend of yours that's, that's doing one of the Optavia programs. But at Optavia, we actually believe that diets don't work. Um, so diets don't work because 85% of people that go on diets are going to gain their weight back within two years. So I love this chart. If you take a look at it, um, this is what we're talking about when we see diets. When people go on a diet, um, their mentality is focused on food as the enemy and foods that are not good and foods that are good. And it's focused on your bad habits and it's focused on things that you're doing temporarily. And it's focused on things that you don't like about yourself. And it's focused on the scale. And usually there's a finish line attached to it, right? Like we go on a diet and we say, I'm gonna lose 10 pounds. Um, but when you switch to a health mentality, which is what Optavia is, you really start to focus on food as fuel and you start to focus on the good habits that are going to serve you best in your life and get you to your goals. And you, and you start to focus on things that you can do forever um, and in helping yourself want to do them forever, wanting to do things for yourself. The daily choices that you would have to make and not just that, that long term goal that you have um, and really a lifelong journey. And we have science behind why diets, diets don't work. And, you know, I told you we have those clinical studies and we have clinical studies that show that, um, that our diet plan um, does work, that it does help people lose 10 times more weight um, than self-directed groups, that it does help people lose 17 times more fat than the self-directed group. And the reason is because we're not just a diet. When you talk about Optavia, you talk about our whole entire system. And it's the Optavia system, it's not the Optavia diet. We have four components to our system. We have an Optavia coach, we have a habits and health transformational system, we have an amazing support community, and then we have our Optavia fuelings and the diet programs that come along with it. And today we're gonna touch on each of those a little bit. And if you have more questions about any of those, Please just go back to the person that invited you this to today um, and they could probably answer, answer more questions and get into more detail and give you more information that you may be looking for. But first, we're going to talk about the diet, right? Because that's what most people start with. And I'm not going to lie, nine out of the 10 people that choose to work with me as an Optavia coach, they come in for the diet. They come in because they want to lose some weight, because weight is an actual fit, tangible thing that they can see that is showing evidence that something is not okay in their lives. They're holding excess weight, and maybe it's contributing to these um, other illnesses and ailments and, and physical things, but the weight is what they see, and they can grasp the hold of. So we have an optimal weight five-in-one plan, which is what most of our clients come in and use. Um, we do have other programs for people that have conditions or are on medications, and we could talk to you about all of those. There's one for diabetes and seniors and teens and people with gout, and there's all different programs, but we're going to go with our most popular program, which is the five-in-one program, and just kind of walk you through it because the others are very similar to that. Um, with the five-in-one program, you're leading with five healthy fuelings and one leaning green meal. Our fuelings are portable, convenient, all-natural, and nutrient-rich foods that are come in a package. Um, the program is cost neutral. Our fuelings have vitamins and minerals and probiotics. In fact, you get 100% of the FDA vitamins and minerals for your day when you eat five of our fuelings in a day. They have no artificial sweeteners, colors, flavors, or additives, and they really have the perfect combination of protein, fiber, and carbs to keep you satisfied and to keep you nourished throughout the day. All of our fuelings have a similar nutritional blueprint, which means they're interchangeable. You can eat any one at any time, and our fuelings are delivered right to your door. Um, we, as coaches, do not hold any inventory. We don't hold any stock. Um, they are ordered by the client through the company and are delivered directly to them. And if you look up YouTube and you look at unboxing, you'll see it's a very big thing in our community that people feel like it's Christmas when the box comes. It's very exciting. 
Um, the lean and green meal that goes with the five and one plan is really very simple. It's five to seven ounces of lean protein, three servings of non-starchy vegetables. You can eat it out. You can take it in. You can cook it at home. There's vegetarian options. The list goes on and on. Um, we ask you to master one meal so that you really have a grip on what a healthy meal will look like and how you can nourish your body and how easy it is to do that. And then we build on that as we get you through weight maintenance. So our goal is not for you to stay on this program forever. And I actually get that question all the time. Like I'm supposed to eat this kind of way forever? Absolutely not. We want you to use the program, learn everything you can about it, reach your healthy weight in a very easy way. Um, and then we wanna transition you. And you'll see we have a program for that. We have a transition program and then what we call weight maintenance. And weight maintenance is we teach you how to go from doing that one meal a day to two meals a day to three meals a day and beyond. Um, so that you are in control of all the food that goes in your mouth. You understand why you're eating what you're eating. You understand how to best fuel your body properly um, to live the longevity of a long and healthy and happy life. So you can see here, we really start where most diets stop. And that's at that step two. You know, started when our clients reach a healthy weight. Then we transition them. We move them to living all of the habits of health. We move them to optimizing their health for their age and really getting them to live that longevity, that amazing, longer, healthier, happier life. So how do we do it? Well, we do it through the healthy, um, through our habits of health system. And this is where the healthy mind comes in. So we start with a healthy body and we give you all of the amazing resources and the tools to get you there um, in the most efficient way. And then we move on to the healthy mind. And we do this, um, what's the word? Co uh, what's that word? Um, I can't even- Cohesively? What, what, Amber? Cohesively. Cohesively, that's not what I was thinking of, but yes, we do it synergistically. We do it synergistically. Um, when you're working on your healthy body, we're also working on your healthy mind. And we do that with the Habits of Health System. So that's created by Dr. A, and this is where the magic really happens. We focus on the areas of healthy weight management, healthy motion, healthy mind, healthy surroundings, healthy sleep, and healthy hydration. And we do that through a book and an interactive workbook and an app and your coach. Um, and we do that through our community. And this is where the real magic happens. Our coach and our community help to bring the Habits of Health system alive. You're given a 30-day journal. You're given recipes. We have a newsletter. There's live weekly webinars. Um, we have an amazing online support system. Our Facebook group is like no other with what we do in there. We cook healthy recipes live. We have community events. Um, we are all interacting with one another. It is just an amazing thing. And we have a corporate team that backs up all of the research and it backs up all of the support that gives us um, their own support, the support calls. Um, we have a YouTube channel, we have iTunes podcast, we have Pinterest. The amount of support that you are just surrounded by is there so that you cannot fail if you choose not to. Um, there is no reason why you could not reach true lifestyle change if you embrace all four aspects of our program. Um, and right here is where hopefully Stephanie is home and all settled in. Um, and if not, she's going to be joining. Oh, there she is. I see her. Um, but I am going to introduce um, my friend Stephanie. <laughs> And I'm introducing Stephanie because she has an amazing journey that she's been on with Optavia. And I feel like you are all going to be inspired by hearing her kind of share how she used the healthy body and the healthy mind, and then also trans transition into where we're going next, which is healthy finances too. So Stephanie, would you be so gracious as to share your Optavia story with us? I absolutely would love to. So um, October will be a year that I joined the Octavia program. Um, I had, you know, been talking to um, my coach <clears throat> for about two years prior, not realizing what he did. He had coached my son in baseball and I had been going through some medical things, um, you know, and really dealing with about 40 extra pounds that I was not able to lose. And about a week before um, I ended up speaking to Matt, I was at my doctor and my doctor said to me, well, you know, 
you're just at a point in your life, you know, at your age as a female where you might just need to accept, you know, your weight and accept your body and, you know, all of these things. And I remember sitting there feeling um, just about hopeless. And I remember this little voice inside my head saying, this can't be it. This is my health. I'm, you know, in my mid forties and this just doesn't seem right. And I went home and a few days later, it was still on my mind. And I thought, I, I'm just, I, I prayed on it. And I, and I literally sent it out there and I asked for direction. And I asked for something to come into my life that was, you know, going to help me. And, you know, from, from a weight loss perspective, but also find a healthy lifestyle for me. Um, I thought I knew how to do it. And, you know, years prior to that, I was in the gym and, you know, I, I knew what I needed to eat and I knew how to, um, lose weight if I needed to, but I got to a point in my life where that was no longer working. Something else needed to happen. And I didn't know how to do it alone. So, um, two days later, I was having this conversation with Matt and he, um, ended up telling me what he did. And, um, I went home and I thought about this and I thought I need to give this a try. I literally just prayed about this and, um, I, I need to, I need to try this. So I did. And I I'm happy to say I, you know, it took me uh, roughly about, you know, three months and I, I got to a, a point where I was comfortable with my goal, um, with my weight loss goal. And, um, you know, almost a year into it, I've been able to sustain that weight loss. So, um, I'm like, it's unbelievable to me that not only did I lose the weight, but it's now been sustainable and living that healthy lifestyle, you know, along with it. Um, and it took me, I think three weeks to make the decision to become a coach. So I was three weeks in as a client and I saw the results happening and I was absolutely flabbergasted. I called Matt and I said, I need to be a coach. This is absolutely just amazing. I need to share this gift with other people. I need other people to feel the joy um, that, and, and it's the most amazing gift. I have to share it. So I, I wanted to just pass that on to others that I knew, others I knew that were struggling in various ways, um, the way I had been with other you know, medical conditions that I'd been battling that no longer were an obstacle for me while I utilized the program. Amazing. Amazing. And, and look at you now, Stephanie, right? And so, you know, it, it brings me into the next piece, um, which is deciding to pay it forward or deciding to share this with others and, and why some of us, some of us do that. So, you know, Stephanie's testimony, she, she talked about how before Optavia, you know, she had some medical issues. She talked about how she couldn't lose the weight. She talked about how she knew what to do and she wasn't doing it or um, that some of the things that she used to be able to do, she, was, it, she wasn't able to do anymore. And that's where the healthy body and the healthy mind piece come in, right? Like we are another way. We are tapping you into resources that maybe you didn't understand before. Um, I also had a health journey the same way. I, I was a very healthy person. Um, I had maintained a 40 pound weight loss for almost 20 years and my weight started to creep up. And I have to tell you, I thought I knew everything um, because I had sustained that for all those years. But when I tapped into the way that Dr. Anderson presented weight loss and weight maintenance and health, it really shifted for me about being thin to about being healthy and about what that really meant versus just the pounds that were lost. So Stephanie's story and my story, and there are abundance of stories out there that you're going to hear from other people that have gone through the same thing. And many of us decide that we're going to become coaches for this program because we want to pay it forward because we have found something that works. And that really brings me into the healthy mind, um, healthy finances piece and, and organizing your life around what matters most. And if you go back to that chart that we looked at in the beginning, when you get to healthy finances and you get to healthy mind, if you're not really high up on that list, there's a lot of life that you're not living. Um, and, and that life is available to you. It's available to you and it's available to everybody. There's a statistic that says almost 80% of American workers are living paycheck to paycheck. I guarantee you, if those people 
took that little quiz in the beginning in the finances part, they're at a number one or a two or a three, or maybe even a four, because some of us don't even realize the impact of living paycheck to paycheck, the impact of not dreaming about the life that we truly desired at some point. Um, you know, I always uh, talk to my clients about when is it that you think you left your dreams on the side of the road and let's go back in the car and try and pick them up because they're still possible. They're still possible. And, you know, before I move further and further in this, Optavia makes no guarantee of financial success. Success with Optavia results from successful sales efforts, which requires hard work, diligence, skill, persistence, competence, and leadership. And you can take a look at our income disclosure statement, um, which you can find on Google, or you can ask whoever invited you here for statistics on actual earnings of coaches. Um, and now that I got that out of the way, let's talk about how amazing it really is to become a health coach with Optavia. So there's a lot of benefits to coaching. Um, you do have better control over your financial future. When Michael and I started with this, this was really just our side business. Um, I called this my fun money. It gave me the opportunity to work from home. Our kids were little. I really wanted to make a contribution financially to our family. I had worked my whole life, but I really wanted to stay home with my kids. And this afforded me the opportunity to, to be able to do both of those things. Um, it started out as fun money, we called it. Uh, we took our family to Disney. We went on a Disney cruise. Mike and I went to um, we went to Napa. We traveled to Italy. We used it really as our vacation money. Um, then I paid for my son to have a communion party, which was an amazing thing for me. And then slowly and surely, it started going into savings for college. Um, and for us, our financial future changed. Um, my husband, who had a really amazing job on Wall Street, um, the the uh, scenery of that whole career started to shift and we actually decided to do this full time and it gave us the fluidity to be able to do that to be able to take this from a part-time job and use it for fun money to use it as um, our, our sole source of income for our family um, it helps people achieve optimal health it helps them give that get that balance between the healthy mind healthy body and the healthy finances it's a virtual coaching business that can be done by anyone anywhere um, and you can build your Optavia business at your own pace according to your own schedule. There's no minimums, there's no quotas, there is no pressure. And if you are here watching this, you were invited in by our team and our community. And you know, we always like to say to everybody, we have a map to get you wherever you wanna go, but you drive the car and you set the pace. And we are not in that driver's seat being a backseat driver telling you where to go and what to do. We are there as a guide. We are sitting there next to you saying, you let me know where you wanna go and I'm gonna take you there. Um, we absolutely have the map. So why Optavia, why now? Well, it's really the, uh, the powerful converging of two important trends that are going on in the world right now. Health and wellness is a beyond trillion dollar industry. And I don't wanna give you a statistic that isn't right, but I think it's something like $3.2 trillion is the health and wellness industry globally right now and working from home. And we all know the impact um, that the last year has had in our lives and how working from home is now more appealing to everybody than ever. Um, but we've, even before that, for people like me that wanted to work from home, there is a lot of benefits to working from home. You get to be a different kind of participant in life if you don't have a commute. And I'm living in the Northeast, and for us, you know, a lot of the jobs take us to the two major cities, which are Philadelphia and New York City. And in order to get to those from the suburbs, you have a commute. And there's a lot that can be done in that commuting time if you don't have a commute. Um, and so this doesn't have to be done full time, but from people by people. But if it is, there are many benefits to doing it from working from home. And if you're doing it part time, you get to do it from home in the hours that you are at home or the hours that you are commuting. We have a very unique business model. Um, it's transformational. It's a new model of business that was started here with Optavia. It incorporates successful elements from a variety of business models. Um, I'll go into that a little bit. It takes a little bit from network marketing. It takes a little bit from franchising, um, but it is not a multi-level marketing company. So we can talk more about that in depth and you can go to the person that invited you there for more information on that and on our unique model, but it's really taken the best of all of the different worlds um, and kind of brought them together to bring um, a business development company that can be both client and coach focused and client or patient focused. 
Um, it stands alone. So when I started this, I did, I only wanted to coach clients. I really had no desire to bring on a team of coaches and teach them how to build their own client-based business. I only wanted to coach clients. And I did that for probably four years. Um, and it wasn't until I had a client that really needed money and a source of income that had embraced everything about the program that I really offered the opportunity for her to become a coach. I saw the value in it. And since then, it's just been an amazing experience to be able to offer the gift of coaching to people and to be able to offer financial freedom to people on a regular basis. I now do not hold that back from anybody. When people work with me, they know they can just be a client. They will also be offered the gift of health coaching, um, which is the expanded model. So what could it look like if you helped a few people? If you, if you help five clients within your first 30 days, you make around $450 a month. If you have 15 active clients at any given time, you're looking at about $1,500 a month. 25 active clients, you're looking at almost $3,000 a month. It is not small money, right? And so obviously the income potential here is these are hypotheticals. Um, you have to work. You have to show up. Um, and if you help more people, the more clients you coach, the more income you're going to earn. Um, how many clients you decide is completely up to you. And the pace at which you work with those clients is completely up to you. Um, we do have an organic growth model, which means our first goal is to create a healthy client. And when we create a healthy client, what happens is they're going to do one of two things. They're going to either become a referral advocate for us and they're going to send more people that want to be healthy to us, or they are going to become an Optavia coach. And the most amazing piece about becoming Optavia coaches and paying it forward, like you heard Stephanie say, is that these clients are five times more likely to keep their weight off beyond the two years. And we have a study that proves that. And this is the outcome of proper coaching. Um, coaching is a skill. We teach you that skill. We don't sign people up for a diet and let them go figure it out on their own. We give them support. We give them accountability. We give them a group. Um, we give them everything they need, all of the tools they need to succeed. And that is what proper coaching is. We also have business coach compensation. If you do decide to go beyond just coaching clients, you get paid to mentor individual coaches and help them succeed. You also get paid if you build successful teams of coaches and doing this makes the income potential significantly higher than just a client focused business. So it's your dreams and your future. And it's really whatever is possible for you that is in your mind's eye. Um, we are here to show you how. I am five minutes over, but not really because I think I started five minutes late. Um, but where do we go from here? Well, really, you get back to the person that invited you here. This is the start of a conversation. Um, and get back to that person and continue the conversation. You can, I'm going to open it up to questions here if anybody has any, but you could get back with the person that invited you. You can ask any questions um, that you have. Um, and I actually have a testimony I, I forgot and your slide didn't come up, Kim, but I would love if Kim Driscoll would share with us um, her story. Kim, where did your slide go? I lost it. It's okay. I'm physically here. here it is. <laughs> Back to the end of the like, wait. So here, you know, I'm bringing on Kim because I really want you to get another perspective of coaching from somebody else who's been ridiculously successful at coaching. And the reason I specifically ask Kim is because Kim also has a full-time job that she loves. Mm -hmm. um, and Kim had not only had a body transformation, she had a ridiculous mindset transformation. And she also then had a financial transformation. So Kim, can you just share with us for a minute? Exactly yeah, what yeah. Optivy has done for you. Absolutely. So, um, you know, I was thinking about it, like, like Stephanie said, it's been actually for me three years in September on September 8th, I started Optivia and I remember it well because it was just a few days before my birthday. And I was just starting my new job um, that I've been at now for just about three years. And I had tried every diet under the sun. I was going to the gym two times a day um, and I just couldn't get under this number. And I kind of like Stephanie said is I was 39 um, and I was about to turn 40. And I just kind of said, okay, I guess this is what happens when you turn 40. Um, that your body just says no. And I watched my coach for a solid year before I reached out to him. And I told myself all kinds of stories why it wouldn't work for me. And I finally said, you know what, I'm going to give it a month and just try it. And I did. And I was a super skeptic. <laughs> um, but I 
um, I went ahead and said yes to myself. And what ended up unfolding is my life completely changed <laughs> uh, so much more than losing weight. So yes, I lost 57 pounds um, and it took me basically about six months to lose that. And I, unlike Stephanie said, I'm not ready to coach. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm just a client. I don't know. I don't know. I can't coach anybody. I can't motivate anyone. Right. And um, my coach was like, I think you actually could, you're motivating people. And I sent him some people and I finally decided my mom wanted to do plan. And I said, I'm going to coach my mom. I'm not going to do that to you. Um, so I went ahead and started coaching my mom. And what I found was this is my passion, right? Um, and, you know, I was listening to a training just recently and I, I just thought about the magnitude of it. It took me like five months, six months, because I ended up in maintenance losing more, right? But like I had lost my 50 pounds. It took me five months to hit a goal that I chased for 15 years, right? For 15 years, I did not hit my goal because I told myself all these stories. I was a different person back then. And Optavia, I plugged into the habits of health and the, the community. And it was a community that I didn't even know I was missing and that I didn't even know I needed. And what happened for me was I changed my mindset. And in changing my mindset, I then learned how to dream again, right? I had gone through lots of really challenging situations in my life. And I thought I was, um, you know, coming out of them like this, this great person, which I did, but then I found this and it unlocked all this other stuff. And then I really realized like, I don't have any hobbies. I was a single mom for all this time. My hobby was my daughter, right? Making sure she was okay. And I was single forever. And I met my husband and all these things started to unfold all at the same time. And the, the person who my husband married was the person before Octavia. And now sometimes he's like, you're so positive. It drives me nuts. <laughs> right. <laughs> um, and if you know my husband, you know what I'm talking about, but um, it's, it's just, it's been this amazing thing. And for me, I had this job and I learned like, well, what else do I love? So I decided to start doing yoga and more. And I decided, you know what, I'm going to be a yoga teacher. And I was able to, with my Octavia money, just go ahead and pay for that. Right. And it wasn't a stressor for me. And then my daughter got um, her license. And then um, I was able to just buy her a car outright without going into debt for it. Right. And I've worked really hard to be in the industry that I'm in and get to where I, I am in that industry. And I kept saying like, oh, I just, I love that. I love that. I love that. And I still do love parts of that. But what I see now is a path to early retirement that I didn't see before because my husband can retire before me. And I found this is my hobby. This is my passion. This brings me joy. It brings me peace. And it, it has changed my confidence level. And it has allowed me to realize that through what I'm sharing, I help other people see that it's possible, right? And that's what each of us as coaches do. And each of you guys as clients do. Um, so it's been completely transformational for me in ways that I can't even imagine. If I think about where I was three years ago when I started this plan, I kind of thought I was a positive person. I thought I had a great mindset and I, I realized now that I didn't, I didn't know how to dream. I didn't know how to do this stuff. But what's been amazing is like these people on this call and some other people too, like they're my friends, right? Like they're not just like other coaches that I coach with. They are my friends. They know deep, dark things. And they've, they've seen me through these things and watched me grow as a person and I, them, and it's just my greatest joy is to help a client unlock these things within themselves. So you get fulfilled by fulfilling other people too. So it's just been magical. Um, and I, you know, I could talk forever, but I know we're over. So um, just, it's, it's truly changed my life for the better. And I can only go forward um, coming off convention, meeting all those people and being around the energy of 10,000 other people, just like me with different stories is it's just amazing to be around, to watch and to see. Um, and all you're going to do is continue to grow in helping other people. And then your greatest gift is to watch someone else find that passion and then also help other people and see that for themselves. It's a ripple effect, Kim. It's that ripple. Yeah. Effect. And, and I love how you said, I, I found this community that I never even knew I needed. And I feel the exact same way. And, you know, we hear that over and over and over again. And, you know, I am so super proud to say that Stephanie and Kim, I did not know them before this journey of Optavia. I did not know them before I was a coach. And now I call them both dear friends to me. 
So, um, you know, Kim was a skeptical client and then she was a skeptical coach, right? And, and we tell people, we'll believe until you believe over and over and over again. And, and we're going to dare you to dream. Um, there was a meme that said, uh, you know, be careful being around me because you, you will start thinking positive things, you know, and, and that is a hundred percent what happens. And we don't even know that it's happening when it's happening, but when you follow this system and when you surround yourself with this community, and when you read and do the work in the habits of health transformational system and the life book, and you start to believe in yourself and you follow the diet and you're winning and winning and winning and you're winning at life over and over and over again, it's a ripple effect. And so, you know, it, it just usually ends up with you wanting to share this with other people and then feeling even more joy being able to give. Right. So um, we hope you enjoyed this today. Uh, we hope you got something that you came for. We hope that, you know, the purpose of this is really to to kind of bridge the gap between what maybe you thought this was and, and what it really is. Um, and we hope that we were able to shed some light on this. We're going to try and do these weekly. So if you want to hear more, we're going to change up all the stories. We're going to share um, other people's stories from other coaches that that work with us and, and some clients that work with us that that maybe are not yet ready to coach. But um, we, we invite you back. We invite you to continue the conversation. We invite you to continue the conversation with the person that invited you here. We have an amazing group that we, um, that we talk in all the time, that we post in all the time. We're inviting you to that group too. Ask your coach, ask the person that invited you here if you can be a member of that group. We love to open our doors to people that have a growth mindset and are looking for something more. So um, please come back. Please bring friends and uh, please continue the conversation. Thank you guys so much. Thank you to Kim and to Stephanie and to everybody that took this time. I'm only 15 minutes over and I will hone it down next time, I promise. And maybe my voice will be back and it'll go a little bit easier. But thank you all for coming and I hope you have a great rest of your weekend. Let's go out into the world and do great things together. Bye.